Hello guys, today I would like to talk about how to type your children in React components. So I've got here a default feed app and I have two components. I'm gonna paste them. So I've got a card component which uh, accepts children as a prop and it has type react.reactNode and also we have a header component which also accepts children as a prop, but it has a jsx.element as a type. So it doesn't really matter what, uh, what tags they are using, but we are going to focus on the essence of which one you would actually like to use because there's a difference in them and, in them, and it's really important. So let's uh, start off with the card. Let's use this component. It accepts some children. So let's give, for example, a paragraph of uh, become, become our client. Okay, and it just works. Let's now take the header. We take the header and we'll paste exactly the same thing. So we've got it here and it just works and as for now you could think that there's no difference it just works so what is the real problem but let's say you don't want to paste and this markup with tags inside but let's say you have a header component it returns h2 so why not just put inside uh, let's put h2 here also so why don't you like to return just a string inside so, so let's try it. I delete the paragraph tags. It just works. Now let's do the same thing with this one. And as you can see, the TypeScript yells at us. So let's see what's the problem. Header component don't accept text as child elements. As you can read here, the problem is with a JSX element because it's only accept the JSX uh, types of children. What it means, you cannot pass any value that actually React can handle. You can pass, you can't pass strings, numbers. You can't pass undefined. <laughs> well, it it might be a funny thing to do this, but it happens. And uh, let's see what React Node is actually made of. It can be string, number, boolean. Uh, what we got here, React element, also JSX element. So as you can see, React node is actually a little bit bigger type than JSX element, and it's lets you do a little be, it lets you be a little bit more flexible. So I personally recommend using React uh, dot React node, and uh, I do really think that you should consider using it also. So that's about it. That's how you type your children in React. I hope it helps. See you in the next one. Subscribe, guys. Bye.